Hey guys, so it's been so hot here in Los Angeles. My kids and I had a blast experimenting with some super cool, inexpensive ice activities. Here are our three favorites. I'm Elle and I'm passionate about filmmaking and finding ways to be a great mom. So first, if you judge an activity by how long it keeps your kids occupied, these ice blocks were a huge winner. All you need is a bin, toys that can get wet, and colored liquid. I wanted to do it in layers so that the toys were dispersed and I could get a little color gradation. Um, so I started with a clear bottom, let that freeze, pour cold. It's very important the liquid is cold or else it will crack the first layer and you keep going till it's done. Now I have to warn you, it takes a while for a liquid of this volume to freeze, so you'll have to start this the night before. I gave it to the kids with a few tools. They started with brute force. How do you make ice go away? A hamlet. And then we tried salt. And then finally they figured out that heat would melt the ice the fastest. What else makes ice melt? Hot bottle. Don't worry. Complicated. <gasps> I feel like they learned a lot because they were really motivated to get the toys out. <gasps> Pick it up! Good job. And if you don't have a lot of time to set this up, you can also do something more simple like these really cool dinosaurs. Next we tried ice painting and this was surprisingly not messy and my kids loved it. All you need is paint, an ice cube tray, and toothpicks or I use bamboo forks. And then it's really easy, you just fill the containers up a third with paint, the rest water, stir it up, let it freeze for about two hours, then you stick the ice picks in. You can also tape them in, but I thought this was easier. Let them freeze the rest of the way and you're ready to go. All right guys, let's see how these work. We used paint with glitter and I think the pictures turned out gorgeous. Here we go! Ta-da! Good job, Press! And finally we sailed some ice boats and these are really easy. All you need are small plastic containers, supplies to make the sails, you can use paper or fabric or make it a vacation boat. And then we used aluminum foil as our river. Oh my gosh, yours is going! Mommy, I win! Mommy, I win again! I have to say these were the quickest to melt, so maybe I'd use bigger containers next time, but they were absolutely the coolest to watch. I hope you give these a try. If you do, take a pic, tag us on Facebook or Instagram. I will see you next week. Stay cool. Bye.